will scan the area for aim signatures and update your HUD. Be on your guard. Hey guys, gals, Master Zach here, the Undercover Gamer, flying in with another outfit review. And today we are discussing my homegirl, my ace, the Black Widow, specifically the Natalia Romanova from Earth 1298, sporting her outfit 1998, because this is when she made her appearance. So let's dig into this because apparently this Black Widow had similar powers to Spider-Man and she was in a relationship with Captain America or had some type of romantic relations or feelings for Captain America. She was also leading the Avengers and then they all were killed by a super powered Captain America. So I'm confused. Are you confused? Because I'm confused. First, I'm confused by the outfit. Where are the web shooters? I understand that CD wants to make sure they are keeping, you know, it, it clear that these characters in this game, these heroes are not the ones in the MCU or the comics. So they, they don't want to have that type of confusion. But I always say, if you're going to do a comic scan, make sure it's accurate. We love accuracy over here. So... Just give her the web shooters. No one's going to think that's Black Widow from 1298. Or maybe they will. I don't know. But if you're going to do a comic inspired skin, try to keep it as close as you can be. That would have been really cool to really have the Spider-Man design on there. The web shooters. But then people may ask for, why isn't she able to web shoot? So... I can just imagine the conversations <laughs> internally at, at these, you know, these meetings at the, in the boardroom when they're just kind of going over ideas and, you know, reviewing concepts. From my experience, these, these conversations can be a lot of fun, but when you're trying to really stay within your own lines, but you're also trying to give the community what they want, you can kind of get yourself in some pickles, which they constantly do. So I imagine they came to the table with, oh, we cannot give her the web shooters because she can't shoot webs and it's going to cause confusion to who the character is. Look, I, I don't think it has to be that deep, you know, just give her the accurate skin so we can all be happy and not find something to complain about. Cause then we can talk about the hair, the hair, it is short, but it doesn't have that spikiness. We need the spike in this hair. So it's that's why people are going to call it, you know, a recolor. Because it just looks like they tried to get it as close as they could without really having to put too much effort into making the outfit as close to the comic as can be. So... Uh, and that's why I have to give it a two and a half stars. So I want you all to let me know what you think about the comic. What would you rate it? I still like it. Black Widow's going to look sexy no matter what she's wearing. You can put her in saran wrap and she's going to make that saran wrap look lethal and sexy and hot tamale. Okay. That's my feedback on that. And those of you who read this comic... Please let me know where I can find it. I I'm so interested about this storyline because it's so confusing. There's really not much information on it at all. She has relations with Captain America, but then they're killed by a super powered Captain America. Is he an evil Captain America? Was he a clone? How did she get Superman's, Spider-Man's Superman? Oh, Lord. Spider-Man's powers. Was she bitten by a, a radioactive spider? Did he just give her radio? activeness did he just give her to web shooters like what was that exchange i don't know did he did spider-man bite her and pass on the power i don't know i don't know but my imagination is running wild 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 west is what we are feeling here with these sometime comic lack of accuracy outfits but anyway i love talking about them i love discovering the story i hope you all enjoy hearing me 
jibber jabber, but I'm ready to see Miss Black Widow in action because no matter what, Black Widow is dangerous and she is going to kick you in your face because she is that beard. Now let's get into it, shall we? Enjoy.